The nicest thing about Snohomish County is the diversity that you have in the county from huge manufacturing plants to wonderful farmland and beautiful recreation. And you have communities that have distinct differences across the Northwest where there's an identity to each of the communities and it makes it something you really want to come back to. We're the third largest county in the state of Washington. We're geographically diverse. There's small towns, there's big towns, there's rural areas, there's small pockets of population. It's without a doubt the best county in Washington state. You get here, you have mountains to the east, water to the west. I love this county. It's a county of roughly 720, 725,000 people, and everything you want to do in a community, you can do it right here in Snohomish County. And we're trying very hard to get to a point where that place that we all live in is an extraordinary place. It's a place you want to go to and relax. It's a place you want to have a family, grow your family. It's a place that you can come home at the end of the day and feel it's where you belong. We have about 3,000 county employees who work you know, really hard to do their jobs and support people as they come in. For some of our professional customers, they really need to be doing their business, so they don't have time to drive in, get a parking pass, stand in line at a front counter. Whether it's business or nonprofit or the individual who comes to us with an issue and help them find solutions, I think that's our role. And I think that's what we, we strive to do. The role of county government is to serve the citizens of Snohomish County. People will forget the things you say. They might forget the things you do, but they will never, ever forget how you make them feel. It goes back to when I was a little girl. I grew up here and my mom and dad built a house. And at night, I remember my mom and dad arguing and fighting about what the requirements were, and they were stressed. I remember them crying. And when I got a job here, my dad said, how can you work for a place like that, that treats people that way? And I said, well, I can make a difference. So every day I'd come to work and I'd try to see who was my dad or my mom. Sure, the rules were hard, but you can treat people with dignity and respect and kindness, and you can listen. I was born and raised here. I've chosen to stay here, to live here, to raise a family here to build my career here, and I wanted to be able to see Snohomish County in a different way. I had been a, a print reporter for 10 years, and I was interested in being on the other side of the notepad, kind of going from reporter to supporter. Because it's a very large county, it's very hard to serve the interests of some of the people who are literally a two-hour drive from here. Even with the concentration of citizens that we have along the coast, which is a beautiful place to live, it's hard to get to a central point in order to get the information that they need. The citizens don't necessarily want to come in. They want to be able to do the county business wherever they are. They're busy, they have schedules, it's difficult for them to come in. We have building permits, we have human services, Section 8 housing. And the people who need to get those services need to have them more readily available. I think the way that we do business today is very different than how we did business. 10, 15, and 20 years ago. People now want to be able to connect with their government from the comfort of their home or their office without traveling. And there's many benefits to doing that. So online services have proven very popular with our professional customers. As you get more urbanized, the demand for services goes up. So having those services being able to be delivered is important. We know we have a website which needs to be replaced. To break away from the way the old site was set up, and that was sort of structured around the way the county sees itself doing business. We wanted to do things the way the residents wanted to do business. For those people who have utilized our old website, I think that they're going to be very pleased with what they see with the new rollout. We want to find out what the community wants to know, what they need to know how we can serve them. We want it to be public facing. We're very focused on eliminating the silos that any of us might be working in and forming those partnerships. We need to act the way the public perceives us. And if they call a part of the county, they don't think they're calling an individual standalone silo. They think they're calling the county. We are one county. It is just one county providing a great level of service. This website 
kind of symbolizes the healing process in a way that we're going through and coming together to create something we're all proud of as one county government and moving forward as one county government. And I think that's what this represents for us, our opportunity to do that.